Hello. I was, I was ever so sorry to hear about Haley Roy. Thank you, Emily. And I, I'd just like to say that my thoughts are with you both. It's very kind. Well, I think everyone's quite shattered. Have you seen her today? Yeah, I'm just on my way back. And, and how is she bearing up? In good spirits, considering. Oh, well, that's encouraging. If, if there's anything I can do... I will let you know. Uh, you don't mind if I... No. No, no, of course. Uh, only consolation is that at least you can prepare yourselves for it. Yes. Oh, that was tactless. What I mean I, I, is... sorry. I, I understand what you're saying. Well, when Ernest was killed, it was all so unexpected. One minute we were happy and confident of spending the rest of our lives together, and then suddenly... And you even got the chance to say goodbye. I can't. It can't have been easy. Oh, at least I had my faith. It's all that kept me going when I look back at it. That's what this little homily is about. Sorry? If only I believed in a god in the clouds, everything would be all right. Oh, God, no. I am about to lose the most precious thing I've ever had, but, well, not to worry. I wasn't suggesting How can that... there be a god if someone as good and decent as Haley is taken away? Oh, life can be cruel. Criminals, I... despots thrive into old days, but my wife, who would forgive her worst enemy... Yes, I agree. No, no, Emily, we don't agree. The fact is, the god you worship doesn't exist. Life is just one sick, practical joke, and Haley is its latest victim. Now, you might find consolation talking into thin air, but I prefer the harder reality of learning how to cope alone. <laughs>